It's the 20th of the month. Let's talk legends. Pow, and welcome back to the channel, Dan Who Reviews. As always, my name is Dan W. Make sure you are following me on Instagram at it's Dan Who, and happy 20th of the month. You know what that means, as on the 20th of every month in 2022, Hasbro are celebrating 20 years of Marvel Legends with a little bit of news, a reveal, or a pre-order, and today is no exception, as they have revealed Uncanny Gambit in the iconic yellow and blue uniform. Let me read the press statement that says, to celebrate 20 years of Marvel Legends, here is another epic reveal. Check out Marvel Legends series Gambit figure with Deco inspired by his appearance on the cover of Uncanny X-Men issue 275. 2023 will celebrate X-Men's 60th anniversary. Here's a little sneak peek. And of course, Gambit is another character on that issue that we can now confirm to be coming in the Legends line, as we've already got Wolverine, we've got confirmation of Banshee and Storm. Now, Gambit himself comes with his bow staff, a satchel, uh, a throwing effect for his cards, and also the flaming card effect. All of these we have seen before. It's all just reuse, but he is on that brand new pinless body where the actual straps and the boots are hidden within the articulation and the design completely pinless and the potential of getting a whole x-men team in quick succession means they're all going to be on pinless marvel legend bodies usually hasbro take a while to complete a team and by the time we have some figures are on old bodies some figures are on new and they're not really uniform together so the potential of getting all the x-men on this iconic cover on these new bodies is very exciting now we have already got wolverine on the uh, new body he is completely completely pinless. Go and check out all my reviews for this X-Men Retro Wave on the channel right now. Lots of comparisons for Wolverine. Those head sculpts are beautiful. We've already got confirmation of both Banshee, who comes with two heads, and Storm on those yellow and blue costumes. Now Gambit is the fourth figure. Of course, now we just need Psylocke, Thorge, and Jubilee. Now there are some rumoured free packs out there. If you like to believe the rumours by a man named after a shape, shout out Rectangular, as he's put out there that there may be two Two free packs, which are Forge, Jubilee, and Storm. And now Storm's already been confirmed. And of course, Banshee, Gambit, and Psylocke and Banshee and Gambit are now confirmed. We just need Psylocke. So just three more X-Men characters of the seven on that cover, just to be confirmed now. So I pretty much believe these three packs at this point, which again, I'm not mad about it. I like to know these things are coming so I can start creating some room on the shelf. And they're all on the new pinless bodies as well in an iconic look for the X-Men. This team, they join back up. They use this uniform again before they go off into space. And if you proper dissect that cover, there are some of the characters on the side there that I would like to see in Legends form. Some upgrades, some need a whole new body. I'm talking to you, Lilandra. We shall see. But you let me know what you think of this gambit in the comments below. What do you think of the potential of completing this team in plastic sooner rather than later as they can't be too far away. Always curious to hear your thoughts and if you like Marvel Legends then oh well. You're in the right place. Check out the videos tab. Find the playlist but most importantly please 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 hit that subscribe button. Hit all on the notification bell. Don't miss out on a video and please hit that join button. Become a channel member. Either show some love or join the members club. Much much appreciated. Follow me on Instagram. It is Dan Who. And I'm on Twitter at Dan Who Reviews. And as always, my name is Dan W. And I will, of course, see you on the next one. <laughs>